Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can easily send an email from Outlook to Microsoft Teams. And now a while ago, I recorded a video where you could actually send the Teams conversations to Outlook. Uh, you can find it on my YouTube channel. Uh, I'm talking about the opposite. Uh, let's say you have an email and because you know you want uh, all the content uh, to be in one location in Microsoft Teams, you might want to uh, maybe share this um, email uh, with a particular channel within Microsoft Teams. So let me show you a few ways to do this. Uh, so option number one would be you need to navigate to a particular channel within Microsoft Teams and get an email address just like that. All right, so you copy that uh, long email address, so then you navigate to Outlook. And let's just say we want to forward this particular email to Microsoft Teams. Uh, so over here, all you need to do is just paste this um, you know, email address that you just copied and click Send. All right, and uh, it just gives you a warning message uh, that uh, if we had any links in here, uh, if the users, um, you know, uh, pretty much uh, don't have access in Microsoft Teams to some of the links, they will not be able to access them. Uh, that's fine. Uh, thanks for the warning. All right, here, here we go. So I just forwarded that email. Let's see what happens in Microsoft Teams. Here we go. Um, literally took a second or two for it to appear. Here is my email that I just forwarded from Outlook to um, uh, a particular channel, this channel, the general channel in Microsoft Teams. So this is option number one. This is option number one. Let me show you another option, which is uh, definitely more convenient. Uh, so with this first option, right, we had to go to Microsoft Teams, you know, copy that email address. Uh, we had to go back and forth between two applications. Uh, with the second option, it's much more streamlined. So uh, again, you know, here is the uh, email I want to forward. And instead of forwarding it, uh, all we need to do is just click three dots. And look at this, we have the option now called Share to Teams. And what I like about this particular option is that uh, with this option, you don't need to copy or remember that email address. All you need to do is just type in uh, the name uh, of the uh, you know, of the channel, the name of the team. Uh, so in my case, uh, I want to send it to HR team, this general channel. It actually offers me to do so. Here we go. And that's it. You just click share. And that's it. Pretty much the email has been sent to um, Microsoft Teams. Here we go. This is that, um, you know, other email uh, that arrived as well. All right, um, very, very convenient. Now, just want to be clear, I demonstrated this to you using the uh, browser version of Outlook, right? Uh, but the same applies to the desktop. So if you are using the desktop uh, application and um, for Outlook email, and you want to send, uh, essentially do the same, send an email to Microsoft Teams, um, very easy to do it here. Just select the email, again, share to Teams. And um, essentially, we have the same exact capability from here as well, All right? Um, so essentially, these are the two options I wanted to show to you. Um, in my opinion, a uh, very convenient uh, way to share emails and bring them all to one location if, if Microsoft Teams is the location that the team collaborates in. Uh, and this way, of course, everything is searchable and you can search through all these emails and the text uh, and access any information you have on those emails. All right. Um, again, that's all I wanted to show you today. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.